Rider training episode seven, the stretcher. All right, so this is a stretcher, one of the most commonly um, and most important use, like pieces of equipment in the ambulance. One thing to note is when you lower the back of it, um, or when you opening the doors, this left door lowers back of the ambulance a bit. It's not gonna do it right now because it's not on, um, but just in general, that's kind of helpful. Um, so to take the stretcher out, you're gonna press this lever down all the way, um, and you're gonna pull the stretcher out. Again, if there's a patient on this, you're gonna wanna be like very careful, cautious, and gentle just so it's not too rough. To bring the stretcher legs down, you're gonna extend with the plus button. Um, they're gonna go all the way, and then you're also gonna want the um, power loader or the arm in the stretcher to come completely down. Then you're gonna press this middle button right here. Um, it's a really tiny one at the top. You're gonna press it and bring it out. Once you're out all the way, you're gonna get it ready for a patient. So you wanna lower it to an appropriate height for a patient. Um, and you'll kind of see on each call, it depends. Uh, you would want to lock the wheels. I don't have boots on right now, so it'll stay. Um, you also would unbuckle all the buckles on the structure. This is already down, but you'd want to make sure that the handle on the side that the patient's getting on is down all the way. So just do that. Something helpful, anything that's red moves. So something like this. You also want to make sure it's at the appropriate height. So you just press that red handle up and down. Um, the back of the stretcher is really simple. The catch-all. The catch-all, if you're going into a tight space, you can, um, you know, move. You just hold down the handles and compress it like an elevator or something. Again, the locks are on either side. You have the IV pole over here. It just sets into place and you can screw it to go up and stuff and tighten it. Um, and then the last thing that moves is just the feet. If you need to um, bring them up, you just, all you do is pull this up, it locks. And then you just take this red handle and push it down on it. And that's pretty much everything that's moved. And when you bring it back in, really simple, you're just gonna go up with the leg, so it raises to the appropriate height. You wanna make sure, usually you usually have two people on the stretcher. There we go. <laughs> and then you wanna wait for the green lights. So then you do the minus arrow, bring it all in, and gently put the stretcher in the ambulance. And just one pointer is, like Sally said, always have two people with the stretcher. And the stretcher is kind of the rider's main piece of equipment on scene always. So the rider will always be in charge of the stretcher. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs>